What's going on everybody? Today we're gonna make a quick video just to explain what's going on with this giveaway. And we gotta make this log splitter because you don't know this, but I kind of finished up the chimney and fireplace in the barn over the last week. I didn't film any of it though. I was in get it done mode. So I kind of want to show you where I'm at with that. And we've been hatching chicks. So Needless to say, we've been a little busy around here. Let's go down to the barn. Get started on this log splitter before it gets too late tonight. Then we'll talk about this giveaway. Woo, coming in hot. Ooh, I think I need to do some brake work. All right, so needless to say, we're gonna turn this thing into a log splitter. Uh, like tonight. <laughs> you don't believe me, but we're gonna we're gonna turn this guy into a log splitter tonight because I've got that whole setup already done. Let's go check this out real quick. It is, it's not. 100% complete we'll let that camera get its light let the camera focus there I'm gonna try to do this without a lot of editing too but let's got to remove a couple things here put that to the side don't don't peek don't peek don't peek okay let's get a nice wide angle on this oh whip wrong direction all right, ready for it? Ta-da! Well, like I said, it's not 100% complete. I do have a piece of metal. We're gonna put it right here. We'll finish it out. We'll trim around the outlet. Uh, we're gonna put some wood trim. I bought some really nice cedar. We're gonna put some nice cedar, but it's kinda gonna look like this. And we're gonna trim it out like so. So we'll go all the way around with the trim. And, uh, we're gonna put some shelves in here, right here, where I'll store all my aerosols and my gas cans for the winter. Because the problem I have is my aerosols, they always freeze and my spray paint is never good in the next winter. Same with my gas. So I figure if I store my flammables on this back area with the shelf, the stove will keep it nice and warm. And if you believe that, I'm sorry. I can't help you. Nothing can help you if you believe that. No, but I am thinking about what I could do up there because I'd like to make this a little bit more decorative. Once I get this piece in here, I have a ton of license plates. I don't know if you guys know that or not, but I collect license plates. Um, you kind of see a few around my shop every once in a while up there, here. I think the oldest one I have is an Iowa 1919 one up top there. So yeah. I'm a license plate freak. Uh, and I have a whole bunch of them and I've been looking for something to do with them. And I think I'm gonna outline with the cedar. I think I might do license plates up there. I don't know. But we need to get this log splitter going because, oh girl, we could put smoke up the chimney now. That's right, I gotta show you that. We need to go check out the smokestack or the chimney. I don't know what you wanna call it. Let the light adjust a little bit, come on. Stop freaking out. All right, ready for it? Woo, come on, focus. There you go. Yes, we did get the top on the chimney installed, ready to go. We are 100% complete, we're ready to burn wood. The only thing we're lacking is a wood splitter. For the people who are saying, cut that stuff by hand, you're a man. Urgh. Yeah. No, no, I did that. I do that. Don't get me wrong. I do that. I have, I have the capability of splitting by hand. Trust me. These elbows of mine, I split wood. I'll pay for it for a week. So I'm not playing around. Ugh, sorry. Arm keys. I'm getting tired. You know what I mean? I am not playing around when it comes to this. This thing's going to be burning a lot of wood because we got this project to start. And this garage is going to be nice and warm. No playing around. 
I got a nice wood burning stove. We're gonna keep it nice and warm in here. I'm gonna have plenty of wood. But with all that said, you wanna talk about this giveaway. We hit 5,000. There was over on the Crockers on our live feed. I'll link it down below. But yes, we went over 5,000. But YouTube, YouTube, oh, dirty YouTube. They pulled a dirty trick on me. So my subscriber count, 5,000, you know, 5,300, 54, 55, 56. And then boom, they dropped it. I had no idea what happened. YouTube, uh, the subscriber count just went boom. There was, I was like, there's no way 600 people unsubscribed to my channel that quick. Uh, I reached out to this, uh, a little bigger channels than me. Sometimes some people don't like to be name dropped or whatever, but uh, I was told that, yep, YouTube usually cleans house when you have subscriber jumps like that and or you get noticed or some, you fall in some algorithm or something like that. But uh, they clean house. They get rid of inactive accounts, uh, old accounts, uh, things of that nature. And it seems that I fell into a cleanup when I hit the five grand. But we didn't go below, but... We're just a little bit above. I thought I was well on the way to six. Well, either way, we'll see what happens. I do know that Jason is almost 100,000 and he is so close he can taste it. And he's gonna be doing a giveaway on his channel when he hits 100,000. Now, he did mention that he was gonna pick the winner from my giveaway video. So, mm, you guys might wanna look into that. I'm going to link that up above. You guys check that out just to be safe. Just to be safe. Comment on that video. But let's get this log splitter going. I have to get this thing made today, tonight, because we're going to be starting on some projects soon. So cue in the montage. <laughs> Man, all right, <laughs> we got that done. Knocked that log splitter out, guys. You guys ready to see this end result? I'm pretty proud of myself, uh, quite honestly, to build a log splitter as fine as this one, so quick. You'd almost think it was store-bought, but 100% homemade. Bam, there you go, guys. 22 ton log splitter made 100% from scrap materials at my house by moi no lie 100 percent homemade yeah it's a cruel joke isn't it yep well <laughs> obviously it's not homemade we purchased this guy used over the weekend got a smoking deal on it such a good deal that i'd be dumb to pass it up uh, 
I like making my own things, uh, especially for materials that I can gather for free or at low cost. And, um, you know, it saves a lot of money around here. But this guy, we snagged this guy really cheap. Melissa, my wife, Miss Sony Slope, she finally realized that I've got a lot on my plate and it's time to uh, take one of those projects off my uh, list to do. One of them being that wood splitter. Um, what we made here, <laughs> well, for my deer hunters, y'all know what this is. That's for this weekend. Yep, open the season, y'all. So, yep, we're going, we're going deer hunting, taking the boy out to Os I Osceola, Osceola, Nebraska, the deer hunt. Little girl here. Hi. She's gonna have a spa day with mom. Mm -hmm. Yep. You want, you excited about spa day? Oh yeah, what are you guys gonna do? You have no idea, but she's a hot mess and she needs a spa day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, all right, guys, like I said, be sure, like and subscribe, hit that give, giveaway video because I have a feeling if Jason's going to do what he's going to do, I think he's going to do, he's going to pick his winner on his 100,000 subscriber mark from my video. So I will link it again, once again, up top here. For you guys to go check out so oh and that uh chimney project you better believe i'll keep you guys updated on the chimney projects we still got a little fancy things to do and we'll have some building supplies and i'll bring you guys back to show you uh I, how I, her spa day went i hope you didn't don't forget who this is <laughs> we're gonna go on a walk so i just hurry and pants. yeah but i almost forgot yeah so monday monday folks today's october 1st today's october 1st so monday we're gonna call the winner on a live stream on Monday. That's gonna give you guys Friday, Saturday, and Sunday to be sure to hit that video, subscribe. You gotta comment. If you guys don't comment, I'm not gonna know how to pick the winner. So you gotta comment on that video because that's the video we're gonna be uh, picking our winner from. So hope you guys enjoy. Sorry for that little trick. I know it was a dirty trick, but hey man, sometimes you get pinched for time. You guys. You just gotta go out there and buy it. So, all right guys, I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. <laughs>